Hi everyone, it's Anthony here again, and in this video, I'd like to show you how to use the Rank Tracker module in Market Samurai to monitor the search engine rankings of your new website. But before we get to Market Samurai, let's take a look at the actual process of obtaining a top ranking. If you've been following the 30 day challenge, you should now have a new website containing a single article. The problem is that no one knows about your new website, including Google. It's as though you've built a new house in the wilderness and no one knows how to find you. In the past, this was a really big problem, and new websites could potentially remain lost in the wilderness for a very long time. On day 8, you discovered how to submit your website and first post to Traffic Bug. What this does is effectively create a lot of direction signs pointing to your new website. The main reason for doing this is that the Googlebot is likely to find one of these road signs and as a result it will discover your new website. Based on its analysis of your site's content and your link network, the Googlebot will give you a rank for the keyword that you are currently targeting. Let's now imagine that you add some content to your website and also obtain a few backlinks. The next time the Googlebot visits, it will reassess your site and your link network and this time give you a better rank in the search engines. This process continues each time the Googlebot visits your website and as you add content and improve your link network, your ranking in Google will gradually improve. The great thing about focusing on an accessible micro niche is that this process of climbing through the Google ranks can happen much faster than if you were trying to create a website in a highly competitive niche. The Rank Tracker module in Market Samurai allows you to actually watch as this process takes place and monitor your site's progression through the Google ranks until you achieve a top ranking for your theme and category keywords. So let's go and have a look at the Rank Tracker module and I'll show you how to set things up so that you can monitor the progress of your new website. To access the Rank Tracker module, just go over here to the navigation panel and choose the Rank Tracker tab. Now the first step for tracking your new website is to come up here and click the Add Domains button. In this box, you should add the URL or website address of your new website. For this example, I'll use Ed's Vintage Electric Guitar website. And when I click the Add Domains button, you'll notice that my site is listed as my primary domain up here at the top of the screen. The next step is to add the keywords that I want Market Samurai to monitor. To add keywords, I just need to come down here and click the Add Keywords button. I'm then presented with this box. In the Keywords box, you should enter your theme keyword and your category keywords that you identified on day two of the challenge. So I'll just enter the theme and category keywords associated with the Vintage Electric Guitar site. And then I'll click the Add Keywords button. You should now see a list of your theme and category keywords over here on the left. The two asterisks next to the items just means that we haven't obtained any data as yet. Now in addition to monitoring your domain, you may also want to monitor the performance of specific pages that you create within your website and also on other websites such as ezine directories, which you'll be finding out a little bit more about in the next few days. For today, let's take a look at how to monitor the ranking performance of your homepage and also the first article that you published on day 6. For example, the first article written for the Vintage Electric Guitar website was this one here. To monitor the performance of this specific web page, all I have to do is select this link and copy it. And then coming back to Market Samurai, I just come up here and click on the Add URL button. I can then paste in my URL and select the keywords that I want to monitor for this article. To finish, I just click the Add URL button. 
In addition to monitoring the URL of your first article, you should also monitor the URL of your home page. So I'm going to click the Add URL button again, and this time I'm going to copy and paste in the URL of the home page of the Vintage Electric Guitar blog. I'll select the same keywords and click the Add URL button. Now you're probably wondering why I added my domain and also my home page. The domain option acts like a general catch-all and will monitor any additional pages in my domain that may rank well in the future, while my home page URL will give me a way to specifically monitor the performance of my home page. Don't worry if this seems a little confusing at the moment, just remember that you want to monitor three things. First, your domain. Second, your home page URL. And third, your first article URL. Now that I've told Market Samurai the domain and the URLs I wish to monitor, and provided a list of the keywords that I'm focusing on, it's time to set the criteria for my analysis. The first step is to specify which search engines I want to investigate. Basically, the more search engines I include, the longer my search will take. Initially, it's probably best just to focus on Google. The other option here is to include the phrase match results. Often, you'll achieve phrase match ranking before you achieve broad match ranking, so it's generally a good idea to include this when you're just starting out. I can now come over here and select a search depth. This specifies how deep I want to explore the Google rankings to find my site. Initially, because you have a brand new website, you want to set this to 1000. Then, as your site moves up into, say, the top 500, you can reduce the depth of your search to save yourself some time. Once you've set up which search engine to explore and set the depth of exploration, you can then click the Update Rank Data button. Market Samurai then goes to work to investigate the current performance of your website. When you're analysing a brand new website, you may see a lot of minus signs in these two columns. This simply indicates that Google has yet to index your web page. If, on the other hand, you see a plus sign like this one, it means that the Googlebot has visited your web page and assigned your page a rank for that keyword, but at the moment the rank is currently outside the range of your search depth. In other words, your site is listed but is not yet in the top 1000. So the progression that you'll probably notice is that you'll start off with a lot of minor signs, which means that Google has yet to visit your pages. Then you'll start to see some plus signs, which means that Google has indexed your pages, but they're not yet ranked within your search depth. And then finally, you'll start to see some numbers that show exactly where your pages are ranked. For example, here I can see that for the keyword Vintage Electric Guitar, the ranking page, which is this page here, is ranked number one in Google. To explore the ranking of other pages, I come across here and click on this down arrow. Here I can see that another page within the Vintage Electric Guitar blog is ranked number two. Over here, I can see the number of backlinks that are pointing to each of these pages, and I can also see the page rank of the ranking pages. If I want even more information, I can click on this icon, which then brings up a graph. Each time you monitor your website search engine ranking, Market Samurai takes a snapshot of your rankings, your backlinks, and page ranks. This means, as time passes, you'll be able to see a graph of your progress in the search engine rankings. To hide the graph, all I have to do is click the Hide button. So your focus for today should be to add your domain to the Rank Tracker module, 
and add your theme and category keywords to the keyword list. You should then add your home page URL and the URL of your first article. Feel free to click the Update Rank Data button, but don't be disappointed if the only thing that comes back is a set of minus signs. This is completely normal and is just part of the ranking process. In the days ahead, we'll be showing you how to improve your content base and your link network, and as you keep working on your site, you'll be able to use the rank tracking module in Market Samurai to watch as it climbs through the search engine rankings.